In this video, I'll show you how to boost your FPS on PCs and laptops for gaming. From cleaning up temporary files to optimizing Windows settings, we'll cover it all. Stay tuned to enhance your gaming experience. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and optimize your gaming performance today. Gear Up Booster is one of the best programs for the optimization of your ping while you play games, using your wired or wireless connection, so get this paid program free from my description, and play your game with lower ping. Access Windows System Settings and follow the provided guidelines for optimized. Gaming performance, adjust configurations to enhance FPS in display settings. Optimize gaming performance by setting the recommended scale and lowering the resolution, strike a balance between visual quality and increased FPS. Boost gaming performance by adjusting settings, so follow me. Enhance gaming performance by downloading the FPS Boost Pack from the website I provided link. In my description follow the instructions for optimized settings to boost FPS, run the registry tweaks of your GPU, and follow the settings for boosting apps and performance. Run the registry tweaks of your recommended display scale for boosting apps and performance. Run the registry tweaks of your RAM to optimize it for boosting apps and performance. Run timer resolution for less delay. Run this program to optimize your PC for boosting apps and performance. So guys on the way, first step we are going to clean all of the junk in temporary file from all windows. So for that, go for this cleanup tab. Now check mark onto this temporary files, and click onto the arrow reports. After that click on this and like button. Once you click analyze so digital, find out all the junk data of your windows. After that click on the screen button, and remove all this junk from your PC. And this will help you too, making your windows responsive, and for getting better performance. After that go forward to general tab, and there you will find out system settings, app settings, then private settings and then disk drive settings to go forward the system settings and turn on all this option which is optimized performance optimized network disabled error reporting disabled compatibility assistance disabled printer services disabled fax services and disabled strategies and disabled a smart screen these are all the unused services of your windows which most people are not utilizing if you are a gamer and you playing only games on your windows Therefore disable all the settings and turn on differentization of your performance and network. Now go for the air tab on the annual file that disable office telemetry, disable Mozilla Firefox, disable Google Chrome telemetry, and then disable in video telemetry and disable Visual Studio. Disable all the settings. Again, this is youth left for the gamers. Now go for privacy and also disable telemetry task, media player on group, and then protocol. Disable all the settings. Go for this drive, now disabled to perfect, disable hibernation, and disable anti-FF timelapse. Here's some important settings like disable. The system restore point because most people need to restore point if you are gamer. And also here's the search bar for your window. Also we not want to disable it. Now go for the next That step. is about Windows 10. Now you'll do again. Go for the system and just disable the setting, which is disable my people. Disable Samsung services. Disable TP. Check and remove card devices. Simply remove or disable the service of your Windows. Now go for privacy. Disable all the settings. Now go for gaming mode. And make sure to enable the game mode. Then disable Xbox Game Live. And disable Xbox Game Bar. Once you're done, now go for touch. Disable all the touch services. Because again, if you are gamer, you not need the services. So once you download the settings into this of industry tab now go for the startup application here we have just few application on opc which we need to run in the windows starter like here is the real vanguard for development then discord then real client then here is the edge and after that here is the google chrome and voice media for my voice recording so this is the application which i need but i have already deleted all the unused start application for my pc let me just show you how you can do it you need to go for the application which you not want to run in your window startup or check mark on that box and click on the delete button and hit yes this will delete that special application or service from your windows startup settings now guys let's go for the next step on the step you need to go for this network tab and in the very first step, you will find rapidly change the nso now stacked out your here. network adapter i have only one but most people have 
multiple network corruptor, so choose it wisely. After that go for the DNA setting and select the Google DNA from this list, so that go for flash. The inner cache, this will remove or clean all the DNA cache of your windows. And after that, click on the set DNS. Once you set the DNS, now open up your natural connection settings. For that you can right click here, open up network settings, go for change it up to settings, right click, go for the property of the ethernet. Now go for internet protocol vision 4 and enable these settings. And you can check out here, prefer the interface right now on the 8888 and then alternate one to the 88. For for that hit OK. Now let's go for the registry tab and they will find out fixed common registry issues. After applying some optimization from other creators or other YouTuber or somehow you get some problems in your registry. So guys with this tool, you can also fix that. So go for fix common, reduced issues and click on the enable all. And this will select all this option from here now. Click on the fix button and this will fix all the register issue. If you have a vid services, after that you also need to restart your PC.